Hi guys, it is an absolutely spectacularly gorgeous, over the top beautiful. It is an 82 degree day. 82 degrees here in February. That would be Wednesday, February 23rd, 2022. And uh, here's your old clueless moron just doing what I obviously love to do. Uh, I, I, I just have to admit it that uh, obviously I, I, I just love doing outrageous shit. I love driving myself crazy. I love spending money I don't have to spend. I love doing work I don't have to be doing. Uh, I love uh, just... I, I, I am heading into at least a six month, if not eight month headache. Uh, it, it, this is going what the, the the lunatic adventure that I am on uh, is, is going to completely control, absorb my life for probably until November. What what is unfolding? I am probably. My latest estimate is I am probably going to spend fifteen thousand dollars. I'm going to spend fifteen thousand uh, dollars. How many months of my life trying to move the, these goddamn tiny houses from Florida to New York? Uh, I do not need this in my life. There, there, there's nothing about this project that I need in my life. I do not need the money. I, I, I do not need the fucking money that I'm going to spend. Just the money. Okay, just the money. Uh, if I spend $15,000 on this harebrained, chaotic scheme, uh, it is going to take me, you know, to earn my money back from Airbnb and Hip Camp. It is going to take me minimally three years, probably five years, just to pay the out-of-pocket money that, uh, that I am spending on this harebrained scheme. And, uh, but, but above and beyond the, the money uh, aspect of it, it's just, I, I, I do not need uh, the hassle, I do not need the, the fucking back-breaking physical labor, which uh, I really hope is not going to give me a fucking hernia, or then it's all fucking over. Uh, I, I don't need the money. Uh, I, I don't need the back-breaking labor. Uh, I don't need to be dealing w with all of these various uh, assholes that I am going to be dealing with for the next six months. I do not need the stress. I do not need the pressure. I do not need the fucking aggravation. I do not need the fucking bullshit that I am inviting into my life with my eyes wide open knowing exactly what uh, I, I am getting ready to get involved in. Now, of course, I could just be buying the lumber in New York. If I, if I wanted to build these fucking tiny houses in New York, I could just buy the lumber from, uh, you know, some Amish guy in fucking New York and, and get rid of all of this. But, but what it is, is you cannot get this lumber in New York which is this uh, gorgeous, this cypress and cedar wood uh, that, that I've, already, I, I've already paid for it once. Uh, I've already bought the fucking lumber and, and all of the uh, measuring and sawing has been done. 
I'm, I mean, the wood is, has already been milled. The trees are already dead. Uh, I, have, I have done all of the uh, goddamn, I think that was my turn while I'm sitting here ranting. Uh, you see what I'm saying? I, I mean, I, I, I've done all of the fucking work, all of the measuring, all of the sawing. Uh, so essentially what I have are these two kits, you know, for the kitchen and the tiny house. I've measured every, I, I've labeled every fucking board. And so it's just, just a matter of uh, putting the boards back together. We don't have to measure or saw a single board. We just have to get these fucking uh, eight tons of goddamn wood uh, lumber. I've got to get them onto a truck. I've got to get them off of a truck in New York. And then I have got to get uh, the, these, uh, these mountains of, of lumber up the side of a mountain. Uh, just, uh, I, I, I don't know, uh, helicopter, I've had helicopter uh, recommended to me, I've had blimp recommended to me, uh, pack horse, mule train, uh, you know, that what I'm trying to do is bring up the prefabricated walls and flooring up the side of this mountain. Uh, each one of these uh, prefab walls uh, weighs about 300 pounds and the floor, my God, could easily weigh 500 pounds. These 8 foot by 10 foot free prefab walls need to get up the fucking side of a mountain. Now at least my neighbor, my old man neighbor, I was talking to him last night, and we were talking about, you, you know, that these loggers up there, that they have all kinds of machines, uh, skitters and forks and things like that, that uh, he goes, surely you're going to be able to, to uh, drum up somebody, some sort of logger, who will just be able to scoop these damn things up, either in a fork or a claw or a bucket, whatever, uh, and they'll be able to uh, get these goddamn things up that mountain. Uh, half the fucking job is bringing this shit uh, up the hill. Uh, I, I, I have completely lost my mind. Then what I started thinking is, all right, I'm going to be running my Airbnb and, and, and my fucking hip camp up there this summer, and, and I'm going to have these fucking construction projects going on. Not only am I going to have the goddamn mess of all of this lumber and construction equipment, but, the, you know, banging and sawing and uh, and all of this crap going on all day. I, I'm, I'm sure the people at the Airbnb and the hip camp uh, really want to come to fucking Bugs in a Jar Farm to, you know, to pay for a nice relaxing time in, in, in the goddamn forest and, and have some clueless fucking morons, uh, you know, out there hammering and banging and cussing and uh, fucking mixing up concrete and Good fucking God, uh, I would be I would be pissed off. So I I can't even be renting out. I, I can't be making any money off of what's now a campsite because it's I, I would I would probably make more money at least this summer if I never bring the shit up there. All the all bringing the shit up here is going to do is cost me business. It's going to lose me fucking money uh, from every way I look at this fucking bullshit. And like, what in the fuck are you thinking, Hammond? Why in the fuck are are you putting yourself through this? And and obviously the only fucking answer is, is I'm a fucking lunatic.
Uh, I am, uh, as uh, Night Skylight labeled me correctly, I am an absurdity. There is nobody in their right fucking mind, especially some 62-year-old man uh, with a bad fucking back, uh, a wrecked shoulder, and, and uh, under no financial pressure to, to do this. They're, 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 what the fuck? You know, I mean, if I was half my age, and I uh, was, was still in good physical shape and, and, and all of this, it would make a little bit of sense. I, I, I'm a fucking 62-year-old white man with a bad back and shoulder. What, what the fuck am I thinking? But obviously, I love it because this is what I love to do. Now, of course, I would have the tunes going this is what I love to do. I, uh, I absolutely love to do this. That's why I'm doing it. Uh, li living the Hambone uh, way. It's, uh, I'm driving down these beautiful back roads uh, on this absolutely gorgeous day, listening to my tunes on the Pandora. Uh, going out there shopping for all of this wood. You should see this unbelievably gorgeous uh, cedar wood that I just found today. My God, I, I, I would like to move the whole pile of this stuff uh, up, there, up there to New York. This dude wants 50 bucks a slab for this unbelievably gorgeous red cedar. I could probably sell that shit for $300 a board in, uh, in, in New York. Uh, I mean, this is why we do shit. This is why we're fucked. Everything about this project is planet eating. From beginning to end, Every single thing uh, about this project is bad for this planet. Uh, I, it is completely unsustainable. It's unnecessary. It's indefensible. Uh, it, it, it is pure planet eating. Uh, and here I am dedicating the next six fucking months of my goddamn life. What the fuck? What the hell is... Oh, this is the Florida Turnpike that we're going under. Fucking Florida Turnpike. But it's heading my way to my new piece of uh, property, my new piece of swampland. I'm hoping, uh, you know, that this absolutely indefensible environmental ecological planet-eating boondoggle uh, unfolding down here in Florida, this motherfucking turnpike. Uh, it, it's going to end uh, about two miles uh, from uh, you know from this new lot that I bought, uh, and the day that fucking uh, turnpike opens, uh, the value of that fucking lot is going to double uh, overnight. You can't fucking beat them. You cannot beat them. You may as well fucking enjoy it, and while you still can. Uh, just play the fucking game. Anyway, we are just, just, just completely fucked. Completely fucked. Uh, and I am doing my part to, uh, you know, to my little bitty part. Every single thing I'm doing. Uh, I, I am I cannot imagine how many gallons of fossil fuels I'm getting ready to uh, that, that I'm getting ready to burn uh, on, on this fucking truck from Florida to New York probably gets about eight miles a gallon fucking uh, gallon of fuel is what well, was probably five dollars a fucking gallon. Uh, to move this goddamn truck. Uh, anyway.
Where the fuck am I? This is 48 East. I'm gonna race this 18 wheeler. Anyway, I am off to do some planet eating and spend 15,000 fucking dollars on a six month headache. While I still can, I highly suggest you get out there and uh, spend $15,000 on a fucking headache while you still can. Oh God, we got another lumber mill off here. I just can't, I just can't, but I can't pass up a lumber mill. Bye guys.